All right, welcome to my February 25th live item shop review video. We should be getting the brand new Icon Series skin, Flakes Power. Let's go to the tippy top and see. There it is. Let's go. The Flakes Power Pack. By the way, you can also get this free badge of glory back bling right now. In fact, if you watch the FNCS Twitch eligible streamers for 30 minutes, I did a video on that if you want to find out more. So oddly enough, it doesn't look like you can purchase the Flakes Power skin individually. They made it so you have to buy the bundle. Hmm, that's interesting. Well, how much is it? I actually won it from the Flakes Power Cup. So let's go take a look if we try to gift it to somebody. So it looks like 1800 V-Bucks. That's exactly what it says right here. Interesting, okay. So that's not bad. Under 2000 V-Bucks, you get the skin, the back bling, the pickaxes, and the built-in Get Flaky emote. Now, if you're on the fence on this skin, I highly encourage you to watch my gameplay and review because I think this is one of the best built-in emotes in the game. It will transition you from the Flakes Power default style into the Phantom Power secondary style, but in addition, all your accessories, your back bling and your pickaxe will transform as well. So you'll go from this one to this one, and then obviously from the pickaxes, the blue to the white. So that means you can enjoy every single style for the skin and the accessories in a game at will. You don't have to back out and swap to another style. You can just do the emote and go to the secondary style in a full combo and then do the emote again to go back. Not all built-in emotes will do that. Some will, but not all of them. Most will just transition your skin to the secondary style. But the fact that this does it for all his accessories as well is perfect. I love it. And of course, congratulations to Flakes Power, the Brazilian YouTuber, almost 10 million on YouTube, insane. But like I said, if you're on the fence, please check out my gameplay and review. So we're going to rapid fire the rest of this because I do have company coming over tonight. We got the Lucha Bundle, the Wrestler skins. Why do people say Wrestler instead of Wrestlers? I don't know. I always thought that was funny though. Dynamo, Mass Fury, the Libre, the Pile Driver. Pretty good bundle. Dummy skin is back with the Crash Test Wrap and the Noggin. Of course, these do have a carbon fiber style. Nice. The Operation Black Tabby Bundle makes a return. This one didn't really sell that well, but it does have one of the best names for a style ever. It's called I love it. And then all these other ones are pretty silly as well. And a nice back bling, some pretty sweet pickaxes, a decent wrap, and you get a banner as well. Cool. The Venture Bundle's back, Venturion and Ventura. They also have a secondary blood red style. I love that color of red. Boy, he's creepy. I didn't notice his eyes were that mean. It's only on that style, too. Same thing for Ventura. Airfoil is just an okay pickaxe. I don't know. I wish I had the secondary style, but it doesn't. Neither does the Triumph Glider. Give me the blood red styles, please. Why the heck is a goat still in the shop? This is like day four. Eh. She, of course, was the goat simulator promotion. Prickly Patroller makes a return. A nice meme skin. Penny's back. Oh, I love Penny. She's amazing with her cat style for Halloween. Perfect. I love her two-toned hair as well. Beautiful. Penny's the best. Her back bling's kind of eh, though. Death Valley makes a return. This used to be super rare, but it's been back umpteen times. Now, Fortnite is a great synced emote, especially in this medieval-themed season. Beautiful. Hey, the Prickly Pose is back. I don't think I've ever seen the Prickly Pose out at the same time as Prickly Patroller. Amazing. And then the twist from Chapter 1, Season 5. Nice. And then we have all the returning stuff. The Axion Sentinels level up quest pack, the WooWare bundle, which just came back yesterday, plus the gear. And of course you can buy them individually if you want. The Pac-Man stuff with Pac-Brained and Galaxian. By the way, I had a bunch of comments yesterday trying to tell me I clickbaited the video because I said you could play Pac-Man in Fortnite. This is what the emo does. You're literally playing Pac-Man. Not once did I ever mention that you could control the Pac-Man people. But look, I am literally playing Pac-Man in Fortnite by doing this emote. That's all I meant. You should have seen some of the comments. I'm gonna have to do the voice. I'm gonna have to do it. They were like, Simon, you, 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 you're just lying, bro. You can't play Pac-Man. You know you can't play Pac-Man. You can only do the emote that lets you look at Pac-Man, but you don't get to control the Pac-Man players. That's what they say. I was like, what in the world? Have you seen clickbait? Like, clickbait is completely 
devious. If I said, for example, Travis Scott is in the item shop tonight, that's clickbait. There's no Travis Scott. There's no reference to Travis Scott anywhere. That's clickbait. Sorry, I just got a little triggered there. And then we got the Captain America and the Bright Star Bundle returning as well. Crips Locker Bundle is still here. And all the most wanted stuff all still here. There's only a few days left for the most wanted event. So get whatever you want out of this item shop before it rotates out. So there you go. Flake's power is the highlight of this shop. But unfortunately, you have to buy the entire bundle. Luckily, it's only 1800 There you go. That's all there is to it. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaborTime.